Okay, so this is our demonstration for double and half stack. We'll just quickly take the beautiful packaged one away <laughs> and you will see that uh, there's actually more than one board in the game box but we're going to just play with one board for a quick demonstration. So we put all the tiles face down here in the centre and we take 10 to start with. Turn them up so that you can see your numbers and your opponent can see your numbers which means that you can see theirs as well. Uh, if you're playing strategically this allows you to block a player from winning. And very quickly we're just doubling or halving. I'd get younger kids to verbalise everything. If you're playing with an older person just for a, a warm-up then you could have a real good speed game where you don't have to say anything. Okay, so I'm going to go first and it's double three is six. Double ten is twenty. Half of eight is four. Double six is twelve. Double nine is eighteen. Double six is twelve. Double four is 8 and you can see that we've started to stack the chips. Double 1 is 2. Half of 12 is 6. Double 8 is 16. Half of 18 is 9. Half of 16 is 8. Half of 8? Actually I think I'll go double 2 is 4. Double 11 is 22. Darn it. Jasmine has used her 22, so I have to wait until an 11 is played before I can use my 22. I can't use my 9 because the 18 has gone. I have to wait for someone to double the 9 and be an 18 on top before I can play my 9. And there is nowhere that I can play my 7. So I have to pick up, and that's my go. Double 6 is 12. And if Jasmine was very clever then, she could see that that was my only place that I could have played the three that I just picked up. So again, I can't go, I pick up. Half of two is one. I have to be really careful here because I can see Jasmine's got an eight and there's plenty of opportunities for her to use those that eight on the board. There's a four here, so she can double the four, double the four. So it looks like, regardless of what I do, I'm going to lose this game. <laughs> so, double eight is 16. Double four is eight. And Jasmine is the winner. The thing about double and half stack is that you might have a quick game like that or you might go through all the tiles. If you do find that you your game is, is an exciting game that goes and goes and you get your stacks piling quite high, you get to a point at the end of the game where nobody can go. So at that point, you would add up how many numbers, I mean, what your score is depending on the numbers that you've got and the winner would be determined by who has the least amount of um, the least highest score and that's double and half enjoy